Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video I'm going to Saint Laurent and I'm going to try on a few beautiful items and after that my husband and I are going to have a quick stop at Panerai and at the end of the video I will be unboxing the items that I purchased recently. I hope that you will like this video. By the way guys if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section down below. Do consider subscribing to my channel, give this video a thumbs up and follow me on Instagram. My Instagram account is the same as my YouTube account, which is black and gold style. Please also consider checking out my other playlists. I have posted quite a few Chanel bags, unboxings, reviews, luxury shopping vlogs, Dior, jewelry, weekly vlogs, style and fashion beauty products and travel videos. I would say I am rather new to Saint Laurent. I only have one jacket from them which I bought a few years ago which I absolutely love and actually wear quite often even though it's a bit warm but it's been a while since I came back to the store and a few of you have been recommending to check out their latest collection. And I'm excited to do that today. Luckily, I have a bit more time and I selected a few items which I will show to you guys as well. I hope that you will like them. I will try to find a bit more time and go back to the store and try on more items, but I'll show to you what I like today. This jacket is kind of cute, but I chose blazers. This one is so beautiful. I really like the color. It's so interesting and i'm going to try it on i feel like this color is going to suit me it's so pretty i was told that the cut of this jacket is very flattering and let me show you the price it's not that bad in comparison to chanel it's pretty affordable and that's how it looks on me i like it a lot this color is so pretty it even looks okay with the jeans that i'm wearing and I think it would look nice with black skinny trousers. I'm actually a blazer person. Well, I love sweaters as well. I tend to wear them for work, during casual Fridays, on weekends. I just find them so comfortable. They keep me warm in the aircon places and I can take them off if I'm outside and it's pretty hot. The weather in Singapore is really warm but it can be freezing inside so you always have to have something and i like the look that it helps to create it's really cool and i like the quality of the fabric it's really nice and i actually like the way it looks with my rectangular mini it's such a cute bag and i like this kind of look a lot it's so comfortable and I also saw this cape, which is so interesting. I wanted to try it on. I don't even have any capes in my wardrobe, but I think this one is pretty cute. Let me show you the price. It's about the same. Interesting. And I like the look that it helps to create. And I think it would look amazing with everything black outfit. For example, black trousers, skinny trousers, black shoes black bag it's really cool and chic i like it a lot it's such a different look what do you guys think about this style do you like it please let me know in the comment section down below i'm very curious to see what you're going to say i always liked capes i feel like they're so different and i tend to wear my jackets on my shoulders sometimes because i just like that look but I feel like cape helps to create a different look. It's a bit more elegant. I'm going to think about this one. It looks pretty cool. I'm just not used to wearing them. And I want to make sure that every single item that I purchase, I'll be using a lot. I also tried this blazer, which is pretty cute. I like the fit and this one can help to create a more slimming look, which is so nice. It's a classic range and I also saw the one like that in white color, but I prefer the black. 
Bianca Jagger worn it for her wedding, which is so cool. Actually, the white is kind of cute. I think I could wear it, but I specifically wanted to check it in a black color because I feel like it's more appropriate for where I would want to wear it, like for my work or even going out sometimes. I like to have blazers. I'm so obsessed with blazers. It's never enough blazers for me. <laughs> I really like the cut of it, I think it's so flattering and if I were to get it I would only have to alter the sleeves, I would have to make them a bit shorter, but the quality is so good. Someone can say oh it's just a black blazer or nothing special, you can find something like that at Zara, well no I don't think so because the quality is so good, you can just feel it, the fabric is so nice and I stopped buying lots of high street items, I mean I shop sometimes from time to time I buy some items but I would rather have less things in my wardrobe but better quality that are timeless and just feel good. It's like flying in economy and then suddenly changing to first class, you just don't want to go back. <laughs> I don't know how it sounds, but it's how it feels. So I would rather get less items, but to have statement pieces in my wardrobe for the years to come. But that said, I still buy High Street just a lot, a lot less of it than before and i'm yet to create a video where i will talk about how my approach for clothes for fashion changed over the years and i'll be talking about this about sustainable fashion the quality and why it's actually better for the wallet to buy this kind of clothes than to go with low quality high street items if you guys are not subscribed to my channel please consider to do so and now I am at Valentino. I'm just gonna pick up the skirt. Actually, my essay texted me and he said that that skirt that I was supposed to buy cannot be altered, but they found a different skirt for me. I'm just gonna show it to you. It looks quite nice. I actually prefer this cut and I will compare it with the other one. I feel like this one is easier to style and I like the way it looks with the blazer. I feel like it's a bit more youthful. And here is the other skirt. I don't know, maybe I'll just end up getting both of them because it's so nice and I can always go back and pick up the skirt. But the quality of Valentino skirts is so good. Should I just get them both? What do you guys think? Please let me know in the comment section down below. I'm very curious to see what you're going to say. And I can always go back to the store and pick it up. And also since I was already in the store, I wanted to try on this pink dress, but I'm not sure I like it. I think it's a no for me. I don't think this dress is flattering. It makes me look wider than I am. My husband and I also went to Panerai to check out their watch. He likes that design. I'm still biased towards Panerai. I prefer Rolex. It's just my favorite brand. But he likes their design and he is considering getting a watch. But I don't know. I think they're pretty cool actually. They look different. I'm just not a huge fan of watches with leather straps. I feel like they will get destroyed quite easy. I used to have watches with leather straps in the past and I remember the pain of replacing them, but they are pretty cool. There were different designs and there are also different sizes. Some of them are very massive. They're so big, even too big for my husband, but some of them are quite cute. Maybe I just need to get used to this brand a bit more. The look of some of these watches is actually really cute. I like it a lot. I just have to get used to them. Anyways, now we are going to have something to eat and I will go home to unbox the purchases and show to you guys. I will start with Valentina purchases and I will show you the gift that I was given for Chinese New Year, which is so cute. I was given this box and it has red packets for Chinese New Year and they added my name, which is so nice. I will not show you the name, but it's pretty cool. 
The design is really nice. I like the colors. And the box also has the cards, which I will open and show to you guys as well. I think it's a pretty cool idea. And I like the design as well. And I got this thin belt that I showed in my video. By the way, guys, I have posted another vlog, another shopping vlog, which I will link down in the description box below for you guys when I actually tried on this belt and some other items. If you remember this belt, it looks pretty cute and I actually don't have a thin belt like that in my collection. I know that I'll be using it a lot and here is the skirt that I bought. I'll show it to you up close. I really like the quality. I'm still thinking whether I should add the second one because it's pretty cool, but it's a little bit shorter, I would say. Maybe I'll try wearing this one for now and see how I feel. And also, I promised to you guys to show you the other dress from March, from my other March vlog that I posted, that I picked up. I like the color. It's a bit shorter. And I also posted a picture of me wearing this dress on my Instagram account. So if you guys are not subscribed, please consider to check it out. It's very cute, even though I'm not into high street now, but this dress is too cute to pass. Anyways, guys, this is it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you like this video. Please consider giving it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. Have a great day and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.